Hi guys. Looker and Tableau are both robust business intelligence and data analytics tools. But which one should you be using? To help you make an informed decision, I'll explain the main differences between Tableau and Looker, and we'll consider seven criteria to see how these two tools stack up. We'll leave the link in the description, and you can use it. You can start with a free version, and if you like it more, you can upgrade, risk-free. And thank you for using the links in the description. So, let's find out which is better for you. For the features, both are full-featured BI tools that include these features. Mobile support, interactive visuals, analytics dashboards, governance and metadata management, integrated APIs and tools. While both software solutions have robust BI capabilities, they each have unique features. Looker's action feature lets users perform a task, such as sending a Slack chat in their data, and its Kabula natural language query integration provides AI features to marketing and customer service teams. Tableau users can optimize dashboards for mobile devices with Device Designer, as well as create dashboards with data from specific software with Dashboard Starter. Tableau provides advanced data analysis and visualization, but Looker leaves its options exposed and accessible. And for the dashboards and visualizations, Looker has interactive data visualization tools and dashboards that let users drill down into the data at row level detail. It includes a library of visualization templates in different formats, timelines, funnel, combined charts, tree maps, but Looker's users can build their own visualizations too. It also includes a drag and drop functionality for users to explore and ask questions in their data. Users can also take action or complete a task directly onto their data, such as sending an email or a Slack chat with the actions feature that has pre-built integrations to third-party software systems. With Tableau, users can create a dashboard in a few clicks, including combining data sources and adding filters. And they can also share their dashboard with their colleagues. Tableau has advanced dashboarding features such as the story points where users arrange their data in a narrative style and the device designer. In addition, Tableau's cloud's dashboard starters feature allows users to develop dashboards by pulling in data from specific software directly within Tableau. Salesforce, LinkedIn Sales Navigator, Oracle Eloqua, Marketo, and ServiceNow. After a dashboard is created, users can set up thresholds in the data that trigger alerts, and they can specify who the alerts are sent to, as well as the type of notification. So while both vendors have robust data visualization features, they each bring unique features to the table. Looker's action feature and Tableau's story points, device designer and dashboard starters. And for the flexibility and customizability, Looker is a versatile software that can be endlessly adapted to specific business needs. However, only tech experts using developer mode can adapt the Looker block parameters, which can disempower business users. Non-techies are limited to the tables defined and customized by the tech team. They can't make calculations based on raw data. Tableau allows business users with Explorer roles to make calculations on the base data, which means they're not limited to table data and have more flexibility. Like Looker though, it's a complex tool and you'll need experienced data engineers to customize the query builder and dashboard parameters. And for the data modeling, Tableau has snowflake and dimensional data models to analyze a large volume of data. These data models are used in a data warehouse to integrate the data with different sources and help to improve the performance of analytical queries. Whereas Looker provides LookML data model, which is powerful, reusable, and flexible. LookML provides analysts with sophisticated tools to buy high-end analytics, and it is the replacement for SQL because SQL is not reusable and flexible. And for the reporting, Tableau is the best tool to create reports. 
you can prepare the customized reports according to user requirements. Tableau uses extensive connectors and fast authoring environment to create and publish dashboards and reports in multiple output formats. Looker provides standard reporting templates to the user. Users can create reports quickly and efficiently by using standard templates. Looker enables ad hoc reporting to build custom reports according to user specifications. And for the integrations and automations, Important Looker integrations include Salesforce and Slack. Looker has a decent range of API connectors with third-party tools, including Google Docs and the Microsoft Office Suite. It's set up so you can easily embed your dashboards and presentations on websites. Tableau users can quickly and easily embed visual analytics into applications like SharePoint and Jive. And there's a social media feature for real-time sharing on Facebook and Twitter. API connections are available for Google Analytics, Salesforce, SAP, and more. Salesforce acquired Tableau in 2019, and customers that use both benefit from being able to analyze Salesforce data in Tableau. If your enterprise has an established Salesforce platform, your sales, marketing, and operations team may also benefit from a partnership with the business intelligence team to better understand CRM data and customer behavior. And for the pricing? Looker provides custom pricing that's tailored to each organization based on their deployment scale, number of users, and other factors. Prospects will need to contact the vendor directly for a quote, but sources suggest it starts at $3,000 a month. However, you don't have to rely on the experience of others. The pricing differs from company to company, so it's better to contact the company directly. Note that Looker offers discounts to nonprofits and schools. Instead of basing the prices on its products, Tableau's subscription strategy focuses on individual users and their data needs. Each subscription includes maintenance, product upgrades, and support at one cost, so there are no surprise fees. Tableau charges varying amounts for different user types, creators, explorers, and viewers. The price per user ranges from around $15 to $70. Note that the pricing is based on annual billing. Companies can also purchase add-on features such as Tableau Data Management and Einstein Discovery. Tableau has a 14-day free trial. For smaller companies, Looker can be substantially more costly than Tableau. For larger enterprises, Looker will be more affordable. So choosing between Looker and Tableau depends on your business and your needs. Both tools come with advantages and disadvantages. It will depend on your current needs. When making the final decision between Looker and Tableau, consider the following. Your existing infrastructure, company size, data analytics needs, types of graphs, charts, or storyboards that work best to communicate with your team, types of accesses you will need, whether on-site or stored on the platform's cloud. However, Tableau is better for data visualization and management, but Looker can give you better analytics and data querying functions. At the end of the day, it's your choice based on your need. If you need better visualization and data management, Tableau is slightly better. For more detailed anal analysis and flexibility, Looker is excellent. Other than that, it's up to you. So yeah, that's it for this video. You can check the links in the description, that helps a lot. Thank you. And hopefully this video will help you out. If it did, leave a comment and click the like button. That helps. And good.